Hello student, this is Shankesh and welcome to Agla Semi School. Today we are going to do NCRT solution for class 6 geography chapter 3 which is motion of the earth. So let's go ahead and know about this chapter. First of all, you will come to rotation. Then you will come to revolution. Basically, these two types of motion. Then you will come to leap year. You will hear about leap year. Then summer solstice and winter solstice. What is the difference between this? इस चैप्टर के अंदर आपको पढ़ने के लिए मिलेगा देन इक्विनॉक्स ये सारी चीजें इस चैप्टर में आप पढ़ेंगे तो चलिए क्वेश्चन आंसर देखते हैं फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन आंसर द फॉलोइंग क्वेश्चन ब्रीफली ए व्हाट इज द एंगल ऑफ इंक्लिनेशन ऑफ द अर्थ एक्सेस विथ इट्स ऑर्बिटल प्लेन सो आंसर इज द एंगल ऑफ इंक्लिनेशन ऑफ द अर्थ एक्सेस विथ इट्स ऑर्बिटल प्लेन इज सिक्सटी सिक्स एंड वन बाई टू डिग्री बी Define rotation and revolution. So answer is rotation is the moment of the earth on its axis and revolution is the moment of earth around the sun in a fixed path or orbit. C. What is a leap year? So answer is earth takes 365 and 1 by 4 days to revolve around the sun. However, for the sake of convenience, we consider a year as a consisting of 365 days. The six hours, that is one one fourth of 24 hours, that are the ignored make one day, 24 hours, over a span of four years. This surplus days is added to the month of February. Thus, every fourth year, February has 29 days, and such a year with 366 days is known as a leap year. D. Differentiate between the summer and winter solstice. So answer is summer solstice. It is the position of the earth when the rays of the sun fall directly on the tropic of cancer. In this position, the north pole is tilted towards the sun. A larger portion of the northern hemisphere gets light from the sun. Hence, it is summer in the northern hemisphere. During this period in the northern hemisphere, days are longer than nights. Winter solstice. It is the position of the earth when the rays of the sun fall directly on tropic of Capricorn. In this position, the north pole is tilted away from the sun. A larger portion of the southern hemisphere gets light from the sun. Hence, it is winter in the northern hemisphere. During this period in the northern hemisphere, nights are longer than days. E. What is an equinox? So answer is Equinox is the position of the earth when the rays of the sun fall directly on the equator. At this position, neither of the pole is tilted towards the sun. As a result, the entire earth has equal days and equal nights. F. Why does the southern hemisphere experience winter and summer solstice in different times than that of the northern hemisphere? So answer is, when the north pole is tilted towards the sun, the northern hemisphere experiences summer solstice. At this time, since the south pole is tilted away from the sun, the southern hemisphere experiences winter solstice. When the north pole is tilted away from the sun, and northern hemisphere experiences winter solstice. At this time, since the south pole is tilted towards the sun, the southern hemisphere experience summer solstice. G. Why do the poles experience about six months day and six months night? So answer is, the poles experience about six months of day and six months of night because of tail of the earth on its axis. Because of ta this tail, each pole is tilted towards and away from the sun about six months each. When the North Pole is tilted towards the sun, it experiences continuous daylight for six months. It is night for the same time period at the South Pole. These conditions are reversed when the South Pole is tilted towards the sun. Second question, tick the correct answer. A. The movement of the Earth around the sun is known as, so options are first, rotation, second revolution and third inclination. So answer is revolution. B. 
डायरेक्ट रेज ऑफ द सन फॉल ऑन द इक्वेटर ऑन ऑप्शन आर फर्स्ट ट्वेंटी मार्च सेकेंड ट्वेंटी जून एंड थर्ड ट्वेंटी सेकेंड डिसम्बर सो आंसर इज ट्वेंटी मार्च सी क्रिसमस इज सेलिब्रेटेड इन समर इन ऑप्शन आर फर्स्ट जापान सेकेंड इंडिया एंड थर्ड ऑस्ट्रेलिया सो आंसर इज ऑस्ट्रेलिया डी साइकिल ऑफ सेशन इज कॉज ड्यू टू ऑप्शन आर फर्स्ट रोटेशन सेकेंड रिवोल्यूशन एंड थर्ड ग्रेविटेशन सो आंसर इज रिवोल्यूशन लास्ट क्वेश्चन इस चैप्टर का थर्ड फिलिंग द ब्लैंक्स ए ए लीप ईयर हैज डैश नंबर ऑफ डेज सो आंसर इज थ्री सिक्सटी सिक्स बी द डेली मोशन ऑफ द अर्थ इज डैश सो आंसर इज रोटेशनल सी द अर्थ ट्रेवल्स अराउंड द सन डैश सो आंसर इज ए फिक्स इलेप्टिकल ऑर्बिट डी द सन रेज फॉल वर्टिकली ऑन द टॉपिक ऑफ डैश ऑन ट्वेंटी फर्स्ट जून सो आंसर इज कैंसर ई डेज आर शॉर्टर ड्यूरिंग डैश सीजन सो आंसर इज विंटर तो ये था इस चैप्टर का क्वेश्चन आंसर मैंने इस चैप्टर से रिलेटेड आपको समरी भी बताया है अगर अभी भी आपके पास कोई डाउट है इस चैप्टर से रिलेटेड कुछ पूछना चाहते हैं तो कमेंट सेक्शन में जाके आप लिख सकते हैं इस चैनल को सब्सक्राइब कर ले और इस वीडियो को शेयर करना बिल्कुल मत भूलिएगा बहुत जल्द नई वीडियो के साथ मिलेंगे नए चैप्टर के साथ मिलेंगे तब तक के लिए बाय बाय एंड थैंक यू Uh, uh, uh.